Hello, welcome to the Met Office 10 day trend. It's been a funny old summer so far with temperatures really up and down from week to week. And that trend continues into the next 10 days. A cool start, but the signs are that it will turn warmer and more humid. And then high pressure will become much more of a dominant feature in our weather through next week and the following weekend. But low pressure close to the UK on Thursday will bring plenty of showers. Best of the sunshine in the southeast, 23 degrees here. Cooler temperatures to the northwest with more cloud in the sky and further showers. Those showers cross the country, clearing away early Friday. A ridge of high pressure then builds in their wake, leading to a fine end to the week for many of us. But rain starts to set in for Friday evening in the northwest. Weather fronts that bring the rain will also introduce more humid air. You can see the airflow there across the Atlantic, bringing in these orange hues across the UK. Higher humidity, yes, for the weekend, but doesn't always mean hot sunshine. That higher humidity will, in this case, translate to cloudier skies for Saturday across much of the country. Quite dull and misty in the west, outbreaks of rain from time to time. That slice of higher humidity becomes confined to southern areas by Sunday. Brighter skies, but also cooler temperatures and a blustery breeze further north. Then our attention, as we go into next week, turns to the mid-Atlantic, where this huge area of high pressure that tends to reside around the Azores during the summertime will extend a limb towards the UK. Now, that may well shove those weather fronts out of the way, through Monday and Tuesday and settle the weather down. Here's a screenshot for the middle of next week from one of our longer range computer models and it shows high pressure very close to the UK. A southerly airflow, that means warmer temperatures, but also higher humidity, so perhaps a return to those stuffy nights. However, that high pressure, although dominant, might not be the only player jostling for position in our weather next week. Low pressure to the northwest, could introduce wind, cloud and rain at times in the far northwest. Low pressure over the continent could introduce some thundery rain for time to time in the south as well. So higher humidity, warmer temperatures, perhaps some sunshine, but not completely dry. The weekend after next, that high pressure may well become even more dominant. And there are good signs in all the longer range computer models that that high pressure will lead to more widely settled weather across the UK. So perhaps a return to summer sunshine, warmer temperatures, but also more stuffy nights during next week and into the weekend after.